Good morning, my name is Chris, I'm a ranger with the National Park and uh, I was just walking along this nice little, little path and realised there's no flowers out on the gorse and it reminded me of a phrase I was first taught in Scotland and that phrase was never heed a lover's pout till the whim is fully out. So that basically means whim is an old countryside name for gorse and uh, you're not meant to kiss your lover unless the gorse is in flower. So there's a few sort of caveats we can add on to that. That is that usually somewhere on the gorse bush there's usually one flower left so you're usually okay on that front. Um, but there's also two species of gorse, there's common gorse and the western gorse. The common gorse flowers from kind of January through till June time uh, and then the western gorse flowers after that so you know there are usually certain types of gorse in flower almost all year round. Um, it also reminded me of a few other uses of gorse so when the flower buds are first coming out you can pick them and you can pickle them in vinegar and that makes a nice kind of caper. Uh, you can also take the, 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 the petals off the flowers and make that into a nice tea um, and also quite interestingly the, the wood used to be burnt for baker's ovens uh, because it produces a very high heat uh, and it was said that the Great Fire of London was started because it was a hotter fire than normal caused by burning gorse. So uh, next time you walk past the uh, a gorse bush make sure you uh, look out for the flowers.